Remember our CGC return? Well, today I got a PSA return back. And we're going to see which company gives out the best grades. Let's get into it. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. We got our PSA return today. 20 different cards back, including some Wizards of the Coast. So without further ado, let's not delay. Let's crack into this. All right. 20 cards hot off the press from PSA. We are going to get into this without further ado. We're going to see which company holds up better, CGC or PSA. Looking pretty good to me. Minor edge whitening, at least a nine on the back. Ah, okay. All right. This is the Charizard 2019 Collector's Chest Promo. I think there might be some scratching. It's very minimal. I'm going to guess a 9 on this guy. Oh, man, an 8. Okay. Hey, I'm good with that. Now, I got this off of TCG Player. I also had a lot of TCG Player cards in the CGC return as well. So I sent them off to both companies to see who gives out the better grades to near mint cards bought off of TCG Player. So far, PSA is definitely winning. <laughs> this was off of TCG Player near mint, and we got an eight. So far, we're looking good. All right, card number two. Centering's definitely off. There's some whitening up there. Eh, I'd say an eight on the back. Okay, there we go. This is our Fossil Moltres Unlimited Hollow. This one was pack fresh. I think it's an eight. Oh, no way. Got a nine on it. Okay, hey, nice, nice. So far, PSA is really, really doing out the goods. It looks pristine on the back. I see nothing. Edge lightning, centering looks good to me. Ah, okay, all right. Oh, oh, non hollow rare from Neo Revelation. Okay, the centering is a little off on the front, not too big. So I'm gonna go with a nine. Yeah, there we go. That is a nice card. I love that. The era when non holo rares actually meant something. <laughs> All right, next card up. It looks good. The centering's a little off, but nothing crazy. Very minor edge weight, very minor. Okay. Giratina Prism Hollow from Ultra Prism. This was also off of TCG Player. Centering's a little off. I think it's an eight, probably an eight. Yep, this was also off TCG Player. Got an eight near mint. CGC was not as forgiving for those cards. Got a lot of five, sixes, sevens. It was uh, abysmal, but PSA, giving me the eights. Awesome. I mean, looks good. There is some whitening down there for sure. Centering's good though. There's eight on the back, probably. Okay, yep. Another TCG player card. The Absol Hollow from Plasma Freeze. I'm going to go with an eight because of that edge whitening. Ow! Dude! A nine on that. See, I was not expecting that because CGC, they gave me crappy grades on near mint tcg player cards nice that's a beautiful hollow though wow all right next up i see nothing very slight edge wear at the top nothing crazy ah shadowless charmeleon original base set shadowless the centering is off on the front but that is a nice looking card also tcg player but i'm gonna guess at nine why not a mint nine shadowless Charmeleon. PSA is already winning on that front. I can't, wow. Okay, looks great on the back. Slightly off centering. Ah, yes. The Mewtwo V Star Glaring Gallery card from Crown Zenith. That looks so good. I'm guessing a nine. What? I got a gem mint 10 on the Mewtwo Vista. Whoa, I pulled this out of a mystery box. Okay, sound off in the comments. PSA or CGC? I can already tell you PSA. And eh, this doesn't 
look as good. There's some lightning on the corner there. Centering is way off. Okay, yep, the Manaphy Hollow from Pop Series 9, also from TCG Player. The font looks decent. I'm gonna have to go with a seven on this one, actually. Whoa, a nine? Hey, <laughs> I ain't gonna complain about that, goodness. Yeah, I'm gonna need all y'all's opinions because right now I think PSA has already won. I mean, you've seen all these grades, they're incredible. I would not have gotten those with CGC, so I might need to rethink things and only send certain cards to CGC. Looks great to me on the back. Minor edge whitening down here, but it's so minor, it's not even worth mentioning. Ah, the ho -Oh GX Rainbow Rare Promo. Beautiful card. Centering a little off. I'm gonna guess a nine on this. Nice! Also TCG player, Mint 9. Okay, PSA wins, but I want to know your thoughts. Sound off in the comments. Looks good. I don't see it. I mean, centering is off, for sure. Minor whitening there. Okay, also TCG player, Zapdos EX from Plasma Storm. And the centering, that's an issue. I'm gonna go with a 9, though. It looks clean other than that. Okay, okay, an eight. I will take that. I figured it would be at least an eight or nine. Again, TCG player. I'm getting nothing but eights and nines. PSA definitely wins as far as value and the grades you get from them. CGC may win with price and turnaround time, but let me know what you think. And what's, what's your favorite pool so far? Just sound off in the comments. Looks Good minor edge whitening, slightly off centering, but looks good to me. Ah, yes. The Mew Hollow promo, Wizards of the Coast. This looks good. I mean, there's some scratching on the hollow part, but you know what? Nine. Let's see it. Um, okay. Hey, I will take the eight. This was from a mystery box as well. That is so nice. We're making a killing here. Minor Edge whitening down there, not even worth mentioning. Centering is off though on the back. And there's our fossil Dragonite Hollow, unlimited. And there is tons of scratching on the hollow. I'm actually gonna guess a seven, unfortunately. Oh, dang, six. Yeah, the scratching on the front is pretty bad. I get that, and the centering is way off, so. Hey, it's a fossil. Dragonite. Love it. Give this video a like. This is awesome. Edge whitening up here, but other than that, it's clean. Centering is good. Ah, the Tyranitar Fates Collide pre-release promo. And I honestly do not see anything wrong with this. I'm gonna go so far as to guess a 10. Whoa, okay, there's our first weird one of the day. How is that a seven? All right, I see it now. There's tons of scratches on the hollow. I still think it could have been at least an eight, but hey, you know what? I ain't gonna whine about it. PSA has already beat out CGC by a long shot in the grades. This looks good. I do not see anything wrong with it. Centering's great. Corners are great. All right, there we go. We got our Charizard EX Red and Blue Collection promo card. I love this card. I see absolutely nothing wrong with it but i'm gonna guess a nine just to be safe there we go mint nine beautiful 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 also tcg player psa is giving me my values of course centering's great minor whitening on the three corners very minor all right the espion and deoxys tag team gx promo from the tag team power collection also off of tcg player it looks clean i'm gonna guess a nine there we go again a nine tcg player near mint card all right oh centering is way off on the back but corners are clean miriam special illustration rare from scarlet and violet also off of tcg player the centering's way off though i'm gonna say an eight just to be safe okay yep near mint mint eight beautiful beautiful 
And I know what this card is. Centering is slightly off on the back, but nothing crazy. Oh, okay, I forgot about this one. I got a Japanese fossil Zapdos. Looks good on the front. I'm gonna guess an eight just to be safe. What? Okay, hold on. I don't see any scratches on the hollow. I don't understand how that got a four. I don't know. Okay, well, you gotta get a few surprise grades in there that you weren't expecting, so we got a couple. Oh boy, all right. These corners are kind of beat up. Centering's good though. Celebi EX, boundaries crossed. Front looks pretty good. Also off a TCG player. This one, I'm gonna guess a seven. All right, hey, I'll take a nine. Man, all the TCG player cards have been eights and nines. PSA gives me my value back for those card buys, for sure. Not sending those to CGC anymore. Looks good on the back. I honestly don't see any problems. All right, yes, the Charizard EX Black Star promo. It looks so good, so you know what? I'm guessing a nine, also off a of TCG player. Boom, oh, eight, I'll take it, nice. All right, last card. And I know what this one is. It looks clean to me. It's our Japanese Slow King from Southern Island. And I pulled this straight out of a sealed Japanese Southern Island set. So I am going to guess the 10. Okay. All right. I will take a nine. I am fine with that. That is beautiful. Our final card, a Japanese Southern Island Slow King promo, mint nine. It is clear that PSA blew CGC out of the water with grades. Sound off in the comments, PSA or CGC. Smash that like button, subscribe to the channel for more grade reveals, and until next time, thank you for watching.